Today we're experiencing an NBA game at three different price points. We're going from cheap to the most expensive tickets. We're literally courtside right now. We are doing cheap to expensive seats, cheap to expensive food, cheap to expensive apparel. At the end, we'll let you know what is more worth it at its price point. Let's go check out the cheaper tickets. We are at our seats. This is section 318, $50. And let's check out the view. What is this? A center for ants? The seat looks pretty simple. We got a red velvet cushion, armrests, Got some plastic. The seats are seven out, it's not bad. View, we are at the center court, so it is right down the middle. I can see both teams. But for $50, I think that's a great price point. And the last criteria is the fans in the area. It seems kind of mellow, and no one's really cheering. It is during a timeout. The ball's about to get checked in right now and see how the fans in the area are. There must not be a lot of Bulls fans in this area because there was no cheering. All right, Justin, who do you think is going to win? We're going to have an ongoing bet throughout the game. You got the Nets or the Bulls? You know, the Nets have been hot, Jeff, so I'm going to go with the Nets. All right, they're down right now 36 to 44. So it's very bold of you to choose the Nets. The winner will get to choose their dream jersey, whatever you want. I'll make you a bet. The loser has to buy the first apparel from the cheap budget. So if Justin's team scores first, which is the Nets, I have to pay for the next apparel. But if the Bulls score first, Justin has to pay for the apparel. We got, who is that? Is that Kyrie? Oh. <laughs> Let's go get some food at our cheap budget. Our budget's only $10 for food, so we have to resort to a hot dog. All right, guys, $9 hot dog. I'm a very simple guy with a glizzy. Let's just go ketchup. That's a lot of ketchup. This hot dog does look a lot better than a normal standard stadium dog. One, One bite. bite. Everybody, Everybody knows the rules. That's a really good hot dog. 7.5 out of 10. Good hot dog. Okay. Are you buying me, Jeffrey? Yeah, I gotta buy Justin something because I lost the bet. $25. Our mid level is $50. Our most expensive is gonna be a $150 budget. Let's see what's $25. They got fitted hats? We're kind of limited in this. No, no, we ain't got no fitted hats. Yeah, this is the section for the 300 level, so, you know, it's gonna be limited. It's $25. $25. Oh, that looks good on you, Justin. Thank you, bro. That's a good hat for $25. Yeah, that's a very nice hat. Let's check out. Let's try to say what's up to Benny. Hopefully he'll give us a high five. Ah! We are going to our 200 level seats, $2 signs. These seats cost us a total of $200. $150 more. We're in section 218. It's in the center, just a level lower. These are our seats. Look at the view. Nice. Bulls have been waiting this entire time, bro. They come back. Okay. Fans. Same exact seat. The fans feel a little bit more live here. Yeah! Yes, yes. Ah! Ah! If you're in Chicago once and this is like maybe your first game, you gotta go with this season. You can hear stuff. You feel the vibrations on the room. For our $20 budget, we are getting tacos. Total cost of this is $18. I think I'm gonna have to go with the short rib tacos. Those sound gas. It's double our budget, so hopefully double the flavor. $20 taco looking kind of slim right now, you know what I mean? That tastes so much better than it looks. Solid eight out of 10. Definitely beats the hot dog. Our budget is $50. We're gonna see what we can get with it. Maybe I'll get a Lonzo Ball t-shirt. $35, okay, that's a good start. How much is this? $10. $10. With a $50 budget, I'm gonna get a $35 shirt plus a $10 number one fan, Chicago Bulls, $45. I think the hat is pretty cool though. A $25 might have been better. We are at Queenie's. This is the most expensive experience of dining. You have to have a VIP ticket and get escorted in. This menu looks insane. What we're gonna do is get an appetizer and a main dish, see how the food tastes, see how expensive it is, and we'll let you guys know if it's worth it. I'm gonna be getting two things that the waiter says is the best. Ooh. We're starting off with a complimentary bread. Oh my God. Looks like some type of cheese. Mmm, so good and tasty. That's the best thing I've ever tasted. This is a 10 out of 10. It's like cream cheese, but nacho cheese mixed together. Starting off strong. We're gonna trust you. One appetizer and one signature. Okay, I'm gonna have your appetizer come up right now, nice and light and classy. Thank you, my friend. Okay. We're gonna get surprised with food and see when it comes out. This is our burrata right here. So it's a fresh made mozzarella. It also has tomato chutney, it has prosciutto on top. 
That is so good. Light, a lot of flavor. Doesn't feel too cheesy. This, eight out of 10. This is a Chilean sea bass. Ooh, get a little bit of everything. There's some shrimp, some type of risotto, a little bit of everything of the sea and a bite. I swear. Are you hitting me? Nine out of 10. That is amazing. The flavors of the fish are so good. There's a little bit of sweetness. The sweetness really helps the fish come out. Risotto is a good base. The fish is very tender. I normally don't get fish at nice spots, but I would get this again. So the total comes out to about 96, almost $100 with tax and tip. And I think that was really worth it for $100. I feel like very taken care of. We're about to go see our most expensive tickets of the night. Apparently, there's some special things that might happen with the Jumbotron. We might get on the Jumbotron just being by these seats. This is us. Welcome to the most expensive $3 sign seats. Before we check out the seats, let's check out the food. We got some brownies and cookies on the table. Everything that you wish in a brownie. Gas. Beautiful, beautiful fruit. I'm gonna try some watermelon. I just dropped the phone. Hello? Okay, bye. Oh, fresh fruit. We got Don Julio, Tito's, Captain Morgan. Oh, whoa, what are you doing here? I didn't know the seats come with you, bro. Bro, when what? did you get here, bro? Dude, we just pulled up. Well, how's the experience of the suite been? Has it been bro, long? it's been crazy. Unlimited food, yes. unlimited drinks. drinks. The mac and cheese was crazy. Okay, I'm gonna try mac, like and mac and cheese. Yeah. Grab a chicken tendies. Chicken tendies. Oh, this is a little dry because it's been in there for a while. Oh. Okay, mac and cheese gas. Solid 9 out of 10. We're gonna go check out the seats now. How much does this seat normally cost? Maybe 6,000? 6,000? I don't know. I could be very wrong. So for a whole suite, it could be more or less. Very comfy. I think it's some type of leather. And look at the view. Wow! The seats are amazing. And when you get a suite, you gotta bring everybody. It comes with like 15 tickets or something. The people here are always gonna be your friends. Food is a plus that we never had at any other spot. Justin, you know what we're gonna do. Another bet. Update on our ongoing bet. They're only down three points now. They are down three points, but they're gonna lose. First to make a three-pointer. You're sticking with the Nets. Let's switch it up. I got the hat on. So you gotta switch to the bull. If the bull's going first, I have to pay for the next apparel. But if the Nets are first, you gotta pay for the next apparel. You get, yep. A oh, three-pointer? Oh my god. Let's go uh, buy some apparel. Our budget right now is $150. All right, I'm going with the Bulls jersey. Three, two. Hey, the Rosen jersey. If I'm going to say any budget, it's definitely going to have to be the $150 budget because you legit can get a jersey out of it. Let's go check out what is next. Yes, sir, brother. Got on the Jumbotron. Had your name, bro. Had my name on the Jumbotron. Bro, up top. I guess now it's time to go on the court. Are you kidding me right now? Bro, we're about to go courtside. Just like MJ. I'm not supposed to step on the court, but bam. This is insane. The Bulls lost. Justin, you owe me a jersey. All right, you guys, now time to determine what's the best price at its price point. Definitely gonna have to go with the $3 sign experience. It was so great. Friends were amazing. I got to get on the Jumbotron, go for sign and experience it. So, so dope. Justin, what was your favorite experience? I like the $3 sign. <laughs> Last video popping up here. Make sure you check out Justin. Link down in the description. Until next time, you guys, peace.